welcome virgos i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back virgos let's get in and see what is transpiring for you virgos all right virgos so you're coming in in action you're coming in using the sword of truth this is really wonderful and positive and what is transpiring here is that uh, um this uh, four weeks period um using the sword of truth is always communication okay so you virgos or really, I'm um, coming in with intellectual information, understanding and making decisive decision. And this is going to be good. So whatever is happening on the work floor, you Virgos are going to be using the sword of truth in order to communicate this so that people understand that you're going to be making um, a decisive decision where I see you're going to be ending a contract for a, um, an Aries man. I see you're going to be bringing a cycle and ending a contract for Aries man. I see Tower Moment is coming down on an Aries man. They have recognized what this Aries man have done. And you are using, um, you're going to be making a decisive contract to, in order to eliminate and move this Aries man out of a position. So whoever this Aries man is and whatever it was transpiring, this Aries man wanted some sort of a new start. I see you are going to be ending some sort of a business relationship with this Aries man. Whatever business relationship you had with this Aries man, you're not going forward. I see you're standing your ground and releasing this business relationship. I see that um, some of you were doing business with an Aries man and other business partner. Um, I see the business partners are going to be voting out this Aries man. They no longer want to do any business with the Aries man. They have recognized uh, some sort of a problem that this Aries man have brought in uh, the corporation or uh, some sort of a business agreement that this um, Aries man have on the, uh, of, uh, on the go. His, um, um, on the go, his, pro his proposition and change um, some sort of a work endeavor. And I see a tower moment is coming down for this Aries man. So a lot of you, um, Virgos are going to do, quickly making a decisive decision because this month is about, um, sudden changes, sudden changes and bringing a cycle and an end to some sort of a business relationship with an Aries man. A lot of you are dealing with an Aries man. Information communication came out about this Aries man and you Virgos are definitely using the sword of truth by making a decisive decision to end um, some sort of a contract for an Aries man and his business partner. So, so let's look at the energy of the cross. The energy of the cross um, is that some sort of information data is coming out where it is going to be um, collapsing a situation. So in the situation is that you come in the cross and you're doing in with a Virgo man, whoever this Virgo man is, was um open that you um uh that you uh airy um Gemini's uh, Virgos um Aries Gemini Virgos. A lot of you are dealing with Aries Gemini Virgos. Once I call it Aries Gemini Virgos, so you come in um this um four weeks period where you know, very ambitious and um, not really on your part, but where a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra, Mars in Aries, Mars in Aries, ladies and gentlemen, and you're seeing the Mars in Aries, it's clear. It is clear as a day. You're seeing the Mars in Aries. A lot of you Virgos are going to be uh, uh, getting some sort of uh, achievement and accolades. Okay. Um, a lot of you Virgos are going to be, um, offered something, some sort of an offer is going to be coming in for you Virgos. Okay. You have another Mars in Aries. So, so you have the sun in Aries and Mars in Aries. So, and Aries, you, uh, you know, first you have uh, the Mars in Aries, and this is about you getting some sort of a, um, offer. Okay. You are being a, uh, ambitious and you're resolving issue situation and you have courage in order to do this and this is going to be good a lot of you are showing your willpower in the right and correct way because it's upright a lot of you um mars and harris bring some sort of information out and a lot of you virgos are going to be receiving a position 
of an Aries person, however, that is happening and transpiring. A lot of you Virgos are going to be recognizing something about an Aries person. Um, you can see that and a lot of offer is going to be coming in for you Virgos. And um, whoever this Aries person is, an Aries person could be leaving and they're going to be offering you the position of this Aries person, okay? Then the um, energy of the source in reverse, some sort of um, information is coming in, let you know um, of the end to a situation, okay? So what we recognize is that whenever this messenger comes up, this messenger is coming in, and if you recognize this messenger is saying to you, Virgos, hey, a situation that you were dealing with the Aries is now over. If some of you and the Aries have been having some sort of an unconventional situation, they're going to be finding out some sort of information about an Aries that is now good. And you, Virgos, are going to be taking down this Aries, okay? You, Virgos, are going to make a decided decision to fire this Aries on the spot, okay? So you see the tower moment. So... Um, whatever the information is and whatever that is transpiring, this information that is coming in is not good. It's, um, it's about the end. It's about you, Virgos, are going to be advised to, to fire F, um, um, an Aries directly on the spot because you found out what the Aries have done. So you got to recognize that. So is that you're going to be using the sword of truth because some sort of information is as if you, your boss, um, said, Hey, um, Virgos, I need to uh, end the contract of Aries. Uh, Aries, some sort of information that come out about Aries is going to be ending their contract immediately. And a lot of you Virgos are going to decide to fire this Aries on the spot. Okay, so it is a situation you can see this Aries Leo or Sagittarian man, whoever this person is, is coming up as an Aries Leo or Sagittarian man. And whatever information is coming out about this man, you Virgos are going to say no more. And we are, you know, canceling your contract. We're ending your contract. We're canceling your contract and we're ending it now. Um, so whatever that was happening and transpiring, you're going to be recognizing that this man, some sort of information came out about this man and you are making a swift, decisive decision, Virgos, to end some sort of a contract for this man. Um, end some sort of a contract at the workplace or some sort of a business contract or um, you are going to be the one that is going to be making the decision to end some sort of a long-term contract with this man, whether in business or whether this man was a manager or so, because some sort of information came out about this man. Wow. So when we look at the tower, okay, because a lot of you Virgos are ending some sort of an unconventional situation that was happening and transpiring. And you are recognizing that this man has been creating problems for your business. And when we look at the tower, it's about um, sudden destruction. And that is the energy of the month. So you Virgos are going to be using your sort of truth to, to end some sort of a unconventional situation. And the energy of the tower is Mars, the red planet of assessment, aggressive. So you can see that... You, um, you could have recognized and received the information, um, the month before or the four weeks before the month before. And you're coming in uh, this four weeks period decisively ready to end uh, a contract uh, and end some sort of a collaboration with the Aries moving forward. Um, cause this Aries had asked for some sort of an offer moving forward and you are going to be saying, no, it's not going to be happening. You are going to be ending it because you recognize, um, what was transpiring. Okay. So, um, that is something that you guys need to recognize what is going to be coming up and transpiring. Now it is going to be a passionate month. Um, Virgos, there's no question about it. As we, as, as you come in the week, uh, um, you know, coming in really with intellectual ideas and ways of uh, creating new process, uh, um, in corporation institution. I see you could be starting a new job. This could be a new job. You could change company and they are going to be offering you and giving you some sort of information that, Hey, we have someone here. We recognize that this person has not been working. Um, and, 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 and isn't understanding the process of what they're doing. 
and we need to um, ask you to remove them. So it's as if you drop in, start a new job, start a new company, start a new department, or you're just at work and you get the message um, coming in in the month of March that you need to fire an Aries. And this is Mars in Aries. So it's definitely an Aries who is going to be getting fired. Whoever this Aries is, whatever is happening and transpiring, I see you are going to be the one who are going to be firing an Aries because some sort of a, a situation came up. And it was an Aries who were asking for some sort of a higher position or management position. And um, you are recognizing that you are the one that need to tell this person it's not going to be going through okay it could be your boss also that you're finding out that bo um some sort of information came out about your boss and um they're going to be asking you to take over their position then when we look at the three of ones the three of ones is about achievement a lot of you virgos are going to be having some sort of an achievement um a new offer is going to be coming in the second week you're going to be having some sort of a each achievement Accurate is going to be coming in for you, Virgos. That is very good. In business, I see commerce and corporation, business deals, and accolades is going to be coming in at you, Virgos, on the work floor. The sun is in, in, in Aries. So this is good because if you, Virgos, were being worked against um, in the third week, you're going to be receiving some sort of accolades because um, it's, it is a situation that information, some sort of information is coming out that is going to be blocking you from moving full, from um, moving the blocks that was transpiring. So whatever the information is, whatever that was transpiring, how people were accessing a situation and trying to block some sort of a situation, you Virgos are going to be coming in and saying, hell no, 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 this is not going to be happening. This is how we are going to be creating this and moving this forward and removing the block because you see the energy of the tower, which meaning some sort of a devastation, something is coming down that was uh, protecting you Virgos at the workplace from moving all on or you Virgos in a business sense or you Virgos that was blocked. So uh, opportunities, job opportunities um, is going to be coming up in the first week going in the second week, okay? In the third week, an end is coming in an Aries the Earth fire sign man. A tower moment has to happen because this man is going to be, the third week is going to be last the last week for this man. Some of you, um, this man will be leaving at the end of the month, but in the third week, a lot of you are going to be advising this man that uh, there is no other position and he's not going to be taken on for the position that he's looking for. Now, um, this um, situation with this man, it has to do with, for some of you is a Leo man, some of you is an Aries man, okay? So for some of you is a Leo, some of you is an Aries. So, now, whatever this issues, this problem and this situation is, uh, that was happening and transpiring, this Aries... Uh, Leo man is going to be affected because a tower moment is coming down because information data information came out so it could be someone who had started a job and um, you asked for some sort of a reference the reference comes back and you're going to be telling this man in the third week that you're not going to be keeping them on so you're going to be ending their contract at the end of the month so in the fourth week is um, a situation where a lot of you Virgos are going to be receiving some sort of a new contract and this is going to be good. A lot of you Virgos are going to be ending some sort of a contract for this man, whoever this man is and whatever is transpiring. You're going to be ending some sort of a contract for this um, man and you're going to be creating some sort of a new contract is going to be coming up for you Virgos. So the fourth week is really, really looking good. So as we move and look at what is the, um, you know, the message and um, for this month that is going to be is that you are going to be standing up using your sort of truth to end a whole lot of people contracts. Um, you could be hired to come into a company and reorganization and restructure a company. Um, this month is about you using your intellect um, in a proper way where you're going to be communicating and uh, disconnect some sort of a uh, on um, on fatality situation, Saturn. So, um, you know, the energy of this um, world is about Saturn. 
the energy of Saturn. Saturn is the planet where bring boundaries and uh, um, decisiveness, deceptive, deceptive, uh, bringing back discipline in a corporation institution. So you Virgos are really coming in and really ending a situation, ending a contract that a Aresley or Sagittarius had and um, really bringing back some sort of a honest stability. You're using the energy of Saturn to bring back um, and bring boundaries and this uh, and defining the boundaries in a corporation institution. So Virgos, this is going to be looking good. Um, Virgos, your first week is good. Your second week is good. Third week, you're dealing with this Aries Leo Sagittarian man. Okay, so you gotta be um aware of this. And then we see this contract has been ending. And then I see a new cycle is going to be coming out and people are going to be recognizing a lot of you, um, Virgos are going to be, um, recognizing and getting a new start. This is going to be good. Whatever the, um, this honest play that was transpiring, I see a cycle is over for Aaliyah and the Aries. Some sort of a contract, a cycle is definitely over. You Virgos are going to be getting this contract and is going to be, uh, moving forward and it's going to be good because you Virgos are bringing back discipline, borders, definiting balance of how business is run in a corporation institution. So congratulations, Virgo. If you'd like to see the energy of this reading moving forward, follow us to the other side. You can use the blue button to join. It's just a dollar ninety nine per month, ladies and gentlemen. Um, and uh, if not, just thumbs up, show your love. Namaste until next time.